a raft. Hmm. What if we make it a floating trap? The first thing to do when building on a raft is to hide the sail and lower the foundation. And here is how to do it. Step 1. Place a fence foundation as a snapping point. Step 2. Snap a pillar to this snapping point to make it a lower snapping point. Step 3. Snap a foundation block to the pillar. Now the foundation is much lower. You might wonder, can we make it bigger? The answer is yes. Place ceiling at the edge as snapping point. Then snap a foundation block to the ceiling. The limit depends on your server config. After the foundation is set, we can put door frames just like how we would build a basic taming pan. Finally, put ramps on one side of the pan. Sarko, a crocodile that can be found easily in swamps, can dismount riders and has zero turning radius when attacking. It is a very good beginner mount for water and land exploration. Preparation To tame a Sarko, we use 9 regular kibbles, 26 trank arrows and the floating taming pan we just built. Do not get too close when luring a Sarko as they will grab riders with its jaw. Location There are a few spots they can be found, but not all of them are reachable by a raft. And there can be large carnivores at some of the spots. So for this video, we will tame a Sarko at the swamp right next to the Dragon Tower, which is very close to our primitive base. Caution! Do not sail to the outer ocean area, because somehow, the friendly whales are very aggressive to rafts. Any raft. With a floating taming pan. Let's find. A Sarko Sukkis. Be careful when sailing, if there are rocks. The dinos on the raft will be dragged off from their position. If you want, you can clear the river rocks and sail closer. I prefer to leave the raft here, which is further away from other carnivores. I found a level 145. Spoiler, I messed up the team. Clear the area and start shooting Trank arrows. Overshot. That is such a waste, because with level 145, if the efficiency was at 100%, I believe it can beat a cave without any level. A thousand years later. Movement. Sarko is fast in water and has decent speed on land. Primary attack. Left click to bite. It can instant turn towards target and I think it is the only water mount that has this ability. Secondary attack. Right click to flip and grab target. Special attack. Press C to lunge at a target. If we dismount on the water or land, we can stand on its back. Sarko is a water mount, meaning that it will stay where it is when we dismount underwater. This allows us to get resources in the water. When riding a Sarko, the rider can use weapons, that allows us to kite water dinos. And that's it for this episode. Imagine having a floating taming pan in the north of the redwoods, that would allows us to tame large sized carnivores. In the next one, we will tame a dino that gives us free oil. Subscribe and press the notification if you haven't so you won't miss it. Happy exploring the water. Dust? Out.